Hello everyone, welcome to Dumb and Mods, and I'm going to take you into an amazing new realm with amazing new creatures. This is a very cool mod. I call it the Land Before Time, because actually I've watched a lot of those because I have kids. <laughs> no, I just like the movies. That's truth be told. Anyway, this is the prehistoric mod, so I'm going to show you exactly what you get to do. There, Oh, there's the time tra uh, teleporter or whatever it is, the time thingy. But that's technical. The time thingy. Here, let's take a look at it. It's the time machine. Yes, that sounds a lot better. So I'm going to show you some of these items here. I'm going to show you exactly what they are uh, when I actually have them. So let's take a look at some of these things here. We have the hadrosaur. We have the dragonfly. We have a crab. Ammonites, we have the Ceratosaurus, I don't know how to say that right, Ceratosaurus, Velociraptor, that's an easy one, everyone knows that, Dodo, Dodo bird, they're extinct, and the the, the Pachycephalosaurus, I don't even know if I said that right, but I don't really care, so I'm going to show you quickly some of those before we move into the other realm, here, where should we get them, because these, sometimes these things are a little dangerous, yes they are, some of them are tiny, I think, oh, and you can hear they have their own sounds, Hi there, sir. They're actually very, very powerful. Oh, 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 oh I know. I'm sorry. Oh, 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 oh. See how powerful they are? Very strong. Diamond sword. That's the way they should be. They're dinosaurs, for Pete's sake. What about this one? Dragonfly. Fly away, Mr. Dragon. Yeah, you're a dragon. Dragonfly. Ah. Oh, and they're very tricky. Where did he go? Oh, forget it. He's too good. He is too good, my friend. There's a little crab. You're not so scary, are you? You watch, he grows. No, he's not that big. Uh, there, And these guys actually are the... Oh, what are they called again? Ammonite. And they actually go for usually for water. And they'll go right down to the bottom. Blink. He's like, ah, oh, refreshing. And then we have the Ceratosaurus. I don't know if that's the right name, but you won't... You know, I can't hear you telling me. Look at that thing. That is cool. I'm going to show you the other realm, though, in a minute because it's... It's very, very cool. And obviously not as powerful as, as Mr. What is that thing again? Hadrosaur. Sorry, I'm not a, a paleon... Is it paleontologist? I think that's what it is. Ooh. Velociraptor, Dodo, and then the Pachycephalosaurus. I don't know what that is. If you say it fast enough, people won't know. Oh. I mean, these things... These things may be small, but they will tear you to shreds. Oh, yeah. It's cool new sounds, too, I gotta say. You silly dodo bird. It looks like a dodo bird, too. I like it. And uh, they do oh, oh, give you meat, which you have to cook, kind of like a chicken. And, of course, oh, there we go. That's the Pagiacephalosaurus. Look at it. Oh, you a big head. It's hard to run around. The lugs. Mm -mm -mm. No sound. Now, remember, this is uh, still being updated, so not all the sounds are, are working properly on it. Eh. Let's go back here. So, we'll get rid of those. Actually, you know what? It'll be faster doing this. Then we'll go here, we'll go here, and we'll go here. Then you can see, I'm going to show you the rest of the items here. Now, in terms of crafting them, I'm not going to show you how to craft them. I'm going to show you a cool feature that also comes with this mod. Very, very cool. Oh, you're going to love, I love the other realm though. It's so awesome. So here's, you know, bug, uh, raw meat if you actually kill the hadrosaur. Uh, raw dodo, cooked dodo, dodo egg, and then the ankylosaurus, I don't know if that's what it's called, but anyway. Shell, you get the shell from killing that other silly thing, mud ball, raptor claw, of course this is what, it's, I think it's like a 50% chance of dropping one of these things. Now these two items here, like the coal ball and coal mush, coal mush comes from cooking um, a specific tree in the actual prehistoric in the new biome, which is cool, and then you use it in what's called a heat compressor, although in my version, the this thing here, the heat compressor, it doesn't really work. And it turns the coal, kind of like in real life, it compresses it and turns it into diamonds. Oh yeah, diamonds, there's so much music. Can we get rid of this music? Ah, oh, whatever, it's nice. It's nice to have it in the background. So peaceful, so darn peaceful and good looking. All right, so let's go with the, I think, no, 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 there you go, the, whatever. I'm not even gonna say it, it's the, Galen Galenimus. Yeah, he's just a friendly little fella. Looks like a prehistoric ostrich. Ooh, look, this guy's still around. Yeah, I know. You want some buddies to play with? How about a 
Adafrolers Nurnorilus. There we go. Oh, look at that. I think, was he supposed to be bigger or is that the actual right size? But I mean, they couldn't make the dinosaurs really, really big. If they made him like true size, we'd be in troubles. Ankylosaurus, he goes, he's like big ank. Oh, there we go. That's nice. I remember this guy. He's a spiky guy with a spiky tail. Although, you know, in Minecraft, you can't really. It's quiet. You got some gas, fella? There you go. Oh, oh, you, you, come on. I hit this guy so many. He is a beast. Oh, sacre bleu. And we're actually in a good uh, spot here. This is the, it's the Thurninorilus. Yep, that's the technical term. There you go. Oh, oh, there we go. Splash, splash. Can you, oh, is he stuck in there? It's not deep enough. There he is. Finally, finally, look. We've got some, some deadly water-bound creatures. Get out of here. Go. Oh. But it, deadly ones. So, it not, you know, it, it, I've always wanted sharks in the water. And this is the closest you're going to get to it. But very cool. I really think it's cool. Uh, and the last one is oh, just tar slime. <laughs> That's right. Slows you down. He looks evil. Darn you. All right. So I'm going to show you the other cool feature. We're going to go into the other realm in two shakes of a lamb's tail. And for those of you that don't know what that means, it means quick. Because... You know, sheep wag their tail really fast. Yeah, that's right. Let's get rid of all this stuff. Eh, eh, eh. Oh, no, I want my sword just in case we come across. So this raptor claw actually has use. The ground apple, I don't even know what you use that for. Unfortunately, the mod page, all the links that they have there are not working. So you kind of have to go based on other videos. Uh, so there, this is actually what I want to show you. There's a time machine. Now, once you have it, uh, I'll show you actually how to make that in two shakes of a lamb's tail. There you go. So all you do is you place it down, right-click again, and you've got yourself a time machine. But we already have one, so we don't need to make another one. This thing, when you place down, it simply collects the bugs. This is a grinder where you put the apples in, and um, it'll actually turn it into apple mush. Heat compressor. My heat compressor in this particular version doesn't work. It's supposed to be one. It's only supposed to be one box here, and it... You put the carbon ball, uh, which is, you know, you use the carbon mush. The carbon mush goes in there and then, then uh, not in here, but in the actual furnace, and it turns it into carbon ball, and then you end up getting that. But my thing is broken. It's broken. And this is what you can do. Look, a claw dagger. If you get the actual, it's a stick. I might as well show you. I might as well, oh, I already got one. I already got one. So here is another cool feature. So you don't have to keep going back and forth to the page to figure out what it is. They actually added a crafting recipe book. So you can see all this. These are like uh, the different uh, types of wood. So they show you how to do it. Simple crafting. I mean, these are basic things. Here you go. This is how you make the heat compressor. Uh, lava bucket, all that stuff. I'm not going to show you. There's the uh, claw dagger. So if you really want to get into the spirit of things and be like a prehistoric dude, and I have no idea what the syringes. There's all sorts of syringes like for DNA and stuff. Don't know what it is. There's the actual grinder. Again, I apologize for the lack of full information, but the problem, the problem with that is that the, again, like the page that I'm on, it's not complete. So it's only like everyone had to kind of guess. Uh, what it is. Anyway, enough of this. Let's go into the other realm because it's super cool. And then I'm going to have to take you to a different realm as well to show you all the features. Uh, there we go. Oh, it's pretty instantaneous. I started down here in the cave, so I just flew up here. Wee, look at this world. New trees, crazy looking sky. Oh, man, this place is so awesome. I s oh, and there, and see, it naturally populates all the little creatures. Where is there? No, no velociraptors around here. Dragonflies flying everywhere. So cool. There's a, even a, I believe a pterodactyl as well. Let's see if we can get out here. There you go. It, it seriously, does this not remind you of like the land before the land? Is it land before time? I think it's land before time. So cool. Like all these creatures just naturally everywhere, and they're beast hard. So if you just think you're gonna go up and there down in the water, everywhere. Look at that. Go ahead, go swim in that water. Look how many there are. Holy breeding program, Batman. That's a lot of. There's, I think there's almost too many. Was there really that many in them back then? I don't know. So I'm going to actually, oh my goodness, they just populate everywhere. Maybe a little toned down. Ooh, oh no, that's a dragonfly. I thought it was one of the pterodactyls. 
pterodactyls. I think that's in the other uh, update, which I didn't get running. Oh, it's a beautiful sunset. So I'm going to take you and I'll show you another last feature, but this world is just filled with creatures everywhere. It's, it's so cool. And there's a red desert as well. I use that as a marker because I kind of got lost once in a while here. Anyway, let me show you the other place. All right, here's another world I spawned in. You can see, depending on where you are and what type of environment, determines what kind of dinosaurs actually uh, spawn in. Yeah, I know. I'm excited to be here too, fella. Here's the red desert. And you can see, I forget what those things are called. Big Hediosaurus. Big Hediosaurus. That's the technical term, of course. But it's cool. Like, there's fire everywhere. Um, it, it kind of, you know, it's it's barbaric, just like back in the, the days of you know, dinosaurs and stuff and whatnot and so forth and etc. Now there's a place around here I thought I I thought there was in the swampy area here or did I miss it? Did I miss it? There's a a volcano. Oh there's some oh there it is. We found it. Now no, they don't always break open like this. Actually they're normally quite structured like on all sides but hey you know what maybe it's made so that it's not always perfect but you get these volcano and they actually go right down to bedrock like i'm not going to go down there but this lava is filled right to the brim and goes all the way down to bedrock and look at these other trees so cool this place the the world the biome like the new biome is so amazing in this I think the, the, the mod creator did an amazing job with this. I mean, what could be better? You could create an entire place like the Land Before Time and, and just have an awesome battle. And the other uh, crafting things still work in here. You got a different look to it. You could have a huge adventure here. And it's way more dangerous. I mean, forget about creepers and stuff. This is actually fun. You could totally do a, an entire series or story with this. Anyway, that's it. I just thought I'd show you this awesome new mod, The Land Before Time. Okay, fine, prehistoric mod. I like Land Before Time. It's more fun. Yes, it is. All right, see you guys next time.